Another important use of AJAX is autocomplete. You've already seen live searching. Autocomplete is, is related, but it doesn't involve actual searching. And here's an example at papermountain.org slash demo slash live. have an autocomplete example using AJAX. All you have to do is type the first few letters of a word and the in this text field and the example is going to complete the is going to search for matches to what you've already typed and give you possibilities to autocomplete what you've typed here's how it works you might type t for example and the word you are looking for is table you can select table from this drop down list like this and table is automatically entered so that's autocomplete it's not Precisely like Live Search, Live Search lets you search for terms that you've that you're trying to find, and you enter a partial term. Live Search finds, goes ahead and searches and finds matches to that term, much like Autocomplete. But then you can click the Live Search link, and you get taken to another web page. Autocomplete is a little bit different; it allows you to save some time just by entering the first few letters of the word you're looking for and in this case you might be looking for rabbit and then you can select rabbit like that from the drop down list that appears so autocomplete is like live search but it doesn't actually involve a, a search per se instead it is simply allows you to complete what your the partial term you've entered into your text field so that's another popular use for ajax and you'll see that very frequently as you look around for AJAX examples on the web. Autocomplete allows you to simply type the first few letters of a word and you can find the rest simply by relying on AJAX. For example here is HE and you're looking for the word head. You can just select it like that and Autocomplete will be able to save you a little bit of time an effort typing in words and it's a very useful very useful thing to do it's not exactly like live search but it's very related to live search again the idea is you fetch data behind the scenes using ajax techniques with the web server and complete what the user has typed by finding matches to the partial term that they've entered allowing them to select among the terms that you su you suggest and complete what they've been typing. So another good use of AJAX you're going to see often on the internet is autocomplete besides live search and that's a good demonstration. You can find that autocomplete demonstration at papermountain.org slash demos slash live.